Look how cool this is. This is a young male leopard by the name of Hosanna. And he is one of the cubs of the Queen of Juma, which is the private game reserve that we're on at the moment. And her name is Karula. Now we're looking for her other cub, Shongile, which is the little girl. So I'm sure she's somewhere around here. Maybe she's just resting under one of these trees. But like growing boys, Mr. Hosanna is probably very, very, very hungry. So being so young and not really skilled in hunting, He's probably looking at trying to catch maybe a terrapin, but you might know them as turtles that are swimming in this puddle of water, or maybe even a catfish. I think he'll be happy enough to get his hands on anything. I just need to listen to the radio for a moment. No, now he's having a, looks like he's having a drink. Oh no, he's just smelling. But watch, let's see if he's going to jump back over this puddle of water, because he's now on an island. So we'll see if we can we can get a view. And and I don't know if you can see that looks like cotton candy growing on the tree just behind this little leopard. Now that is the nest of a foam nest frog. Maybe we'll see one as well. How cool is that? They, instead of laying uh, their eggs in the water, they make them up on these trees in this sort of froth-like substance. And once they hatch and develop, they'll fall into the water. Ah, that must be nice and cool on the ground with all that mud there. I wish I was like him. And he doesn't seem to mind that he's got his tail in the water either. Look how cool that is. <laughs> Look how beautiful he is. He's giving us a fantastic show. Now, all the wonderful kids at Kingston Elementary want to know how fast a leopard can run. I need to do the conversion in miles and feet because I'm absolutely terrible at it. But I'll give you an example. The charging speed of a leopard, so when it is standing still to chasing you, its charging speed is 24 meters per second. Now, I, I don't know what that is in feet. I'm, I'm really, really terrible, but it is so quick that I can tell you that you wouldn't be even be able to blink and that leopard would be standing in front of you. But they can, they can run quite quickly. They probably get up to a speed of about 60 kilometers an hour, maybe a little bit quicker than that, but they can't keep it up for very long. It's a very, very short distance. So not as fast as a cheetah. Cheetahs are the fastest land mammal. But a leopard is not slow. They can definitely run quicker than what we can. But now he's learning, he's not sure what he wants to do, if he's going to try and fish. Nobody, none of the animals are cooperating. Now Evelyn, you are wondering now not how fast he can run, but how high he can jump. Now at the moment, he can't really jump very well. He's getting there, he's learning of course, but he's only 10 months old. So he's still got a lot to learn. However, when he gets to when he's about fully grown, so when he gets to about four years old, maybe four and a half, five years old, he'll be able to jump from the ground about two and a half, three meters up onto a tree before he even touches it. And then he'll grip his claws in the tree and climb the rest of the way up. So they're very, very powerful. They've got lots of power in their shoulders as well as in their hindquarters and their legs. But he's still got to develop all those muscles that will allow him to one day be able to jump as high as an adult leopard can. And maybe mom is off looking for something uh, to eat and hopefully she'll catch something big enough that she'll be able to share it with her two cubs. She'll probably come back and fetch them if she does catch something. But isn't this amazing? You got to see a spotted cat and the most beautiful spotted cat in my opinion that we have out here in Africa out of the big cats. And one of my favorites too, especially young Hosanna and his sister Shongile. They are very special little cubs. And it is so nice to be able to sit here every single day and watch them grow. He looks a little bit confused, don't you think? Oh, I think I need to jump onto the radio very quickly.